Hey, it's Display of Disgrace, and I just want to do a quick review of this movie here. Stay. Um, first off, I really enjoyed this movie. I think it took a really difficult topic to handle. A lot of people have a hard time digesting or even talking about, and brought it to light and presented it in a manner that wasn't kind of like, um, it's okay and wasn't kind of like, um, this is funny, haha, because it's not. Um, so that being suicide. Um, it has someone who was an attempted suicidee who survived, made it out, and was, you know, working through things and still recovering. Um, also had uh, another person who was coming in to being someone who um, is going to be the person who's going to do an attempt and someone who's trying to deal with these situations on their own. Um, honestly, it, you know, very difficult topic to handle. Um, did a really great job on it. Um, the addition of, I guess I would call it metaphysics, um, you know, what's the definition of reality, um, kind of comes into play, um, a lot of kind of weird stuff happens, kind of gives it a bit of mystery, leaving you with the feeling of whether or not um, everything in the movie is real or not. Well, of course, you know, it's just a movie. Uh, everything was just acted out. It's not real. Uh, but, you know, very well, you know, this could happen. But if so, um, it kind of has uh, that mysterious feeling to it. If you uh, like a lot of sort of dramas, um, maybe a bit of um, cult classic. I wouldn't say this one's quite there. Um, the people in the cult classic group would have to define that one. So, um, yeah, if you like that sort of style of thing, you feel up to watching something on suicide, then this might be the movie for you. That is Stay.